Hi guys, does anybody know where I am? Three guesses? Whoever wins, well, who knows what you might win. Well guys, welcome back to another edition of the Fragrantition, but I am in a very, very different setting. And who is here? It's the Queen. Hello! <laughs> The Queen of London herself, Miss South, South London. London. Yes, it's Ange, 50 Cents UK. So, yes, so I've managed to come down to London to see Ange. And don't worry, I can edit anything out. Don't it's worry, fine, it's fine. fine. So, it's fine. Um, so, Ange, what's it like living in London? Well, you know, it's, <laughs> it's fast-paced, as yes. you can tell. You know, lots of people around all the time, never a dull moment, but, you know, that's what I like. Yeah, never a dull moment, yeah. Indeed. And I'm so glad to finally <laughs> meet this one, my Gab star. It's oh. been a long time coming, hasn't it? It has, Let's be because I don't live that far. No, you Not don't really. really. I'm only about an hour, no, about an hour and a half, two hours away. Yeah. So um, next time we're going to do this, there's going to be a third person in this equation. Yes. Because three is always better than two, as you know. Wow. <laughs> and she knows who that person is and she is. she will be watching. Indeed. So comment, please, whoever that person is that needs to come down here with us because we are the real housewives who sniff here in the UK. The three amigos. Yes, the three amigos. We need a yes. night out, girl. Oh, yeah, we do. We really yeah. do. Yeah, <laughs> night out in London. <laughs> yes. Oh, my God. That'll be carnage. <laughs> <laughs> we'd get messy yes oh yes exactly <laughs> yes we'll probably end just come looking for us in some police station i mean yes I, yeah you know i do know some of the coppers in charing cross oh you still know them do oh, you of course From yes back in the day. yeah yeah they were my clients <laughs> <you know. laughs> we are gonna do a blind sniff fest so and just gonna so what i want you to do is after you've watched this video or vice versa go and head over to angie's video subscribe to Ange if you haven't mm -hmm. if you haven't where have you been you've been living under a rock you know you've been you've been living in the north pole um you need to subscribe to Ange only if you want to and no i mean pressure. no no exactly because Ange and i we do have very we have same taste but we do have some very Different, different taste. yeah, of course. Exactly. And we wanted to sniff, blind sniff, five different fragrances that I've never tried. And Ange is going to do the same on her video as well. So without further ado, we are going to sniff the first perfume. Yay! Right, so Ange is going to smell. This is Amouage Portrayal. Oh, I love oh, the bottle. The bottle's beautiful. Of, yes. And can I just say, you smell freaking amazing. Oh, thank you. Thank when she you. walked in, I was like, wow, she smelled amazing. And whatever it was, I thought, that is you. It's and it is what? Papillon Salome. Yes. So Liz, because Liz, Liz does watch our videos. Um, Liz, I'm wearing Papillon Salome. It was either going to be a Francesca Bianchi or a Papillon. And I let Richard smell. And he said, no, I want that one. Because let's face it, he's a man. He knows nothing about perfumes. <laughs> well, he picked well. well. he picked well, yes. Yeah. So I'm wearing Papillon by Salome. And Ange, in her video, she will tell you what she is wearing. Because it's all about Ange in her video. So I am going to spray Amouage Portrayal. Now, Ange. I'm excited. This perfume... Hmm. I don't know if that's a bit of me. Right, I'll I, tell you I don't the notes. Mind it, but go on, what's in it? It's got jasmine in, okay. but it's got a tobacco note. Right. And it's got elemi. Oh yeah, it is a bit it's, smoky. It's got, it's got elemi, which is like this resin, so it's quite resinous as well. Mm. Um, now. I know some people have said it smells quite sweet. I don't think it is a sweet fragrance. No, it's not sweet to me, but then I like sweet, sweet. Yes. So Whereas I don't really like sweet. Yeah, and that's exactly. okay. Yeah, of course. So, yeah, so, I mean, the bottle the is... The bottle is beautiful. And, I mean, I never pay retail. Who pays retail amourage prices? Does this one last well? It does. It does last well. I will say these work better on skin right than they do on paper yeah so but this is quite um it's jasmine forward but it's just i think it's 
I can smell the smokiness in it. There is a smokiness yeah, in it. Yeah, it's got this kind of, it's got, well, it's meant to have this kind of like, in the 1920s, women smoked, is it Cravenays or whatever oh, right. it was? Yeah, yeah. And they were coated in vanilla. So this is kind of that kind of vibe. It's yeah. reminiscent to that smoky jazz club, to that, to that kind of, you know, clandestine feeling, I can understand. I, I can see you wearing this, yeah. definitely. Do you know what? This was a blind buy. Was it? Yeah, but it was a successful blind buy. The thing is, I only blind buy successful... I, you know, I only blind buy ones that I think are really going to work. Yeah. So fortunately, it did work, and I didn't pay retail, because who pays retail oh, prices for, them, for no. Amorize? You know, you, they're, they're like £300. Ridiculous.com. No, I played... Yeah, ridiculous.com. Go real. to allbeauty.com, if you can, or a private seller on eBay, yeah. and make sure it's pack it i always make sure it's in its box yeah i myself it's just me i don't buy fragrances that are unboxed yeah some people do but i don't but yeah amouage portrayal so out of 10 how would you rate out that? of 10 10 being the bomb.com yeah i'm gonna say one being i'm gonna say five five yeah right i don't dislike it but right. i don't love it right i just okay. think it's all right I would wear it. I so would wear it. on the inches scale, it's a good five to six. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you know there's going to be banter. There's well, going to be banter. Us so, being together, it's inevitable. Two Sagittarians. Exactly. Okay. So Amorage Portrayal is a five out of ten. Now, this is Angel's Dust. Oh, I'm excited. This, this stunned me because when I first smelt it, it wasn't a love at first sniff. Oh, really? No, I thought it was going to be another Francesca Bianchi um, that I was looking for, which was Under My Skin. Right. And um, I know Amina, I don't know if you know Amina, She's she used to do videos here on YouTube. Mm. She raves about Under My Skin. So I sampled it and I thought it was okay. Yeah. But then I kept smelling this. And this, well, I'll let you smell it. The spray on this. Phenomenal. That psh, yeah, the psh, it's all about the psh for me. Yeah, that sound, music to our ears. Now this. Oh, I can already smell this without even. Oh, these are. That is a bit of me. These are extract perfumes, so mm. they are stronger than eau de parfums. They last on the skin, easily ten hours plus. Yeah. And on clothes, it'll be for days. This is powdery. Yeah, it is powdery. So it it's and meant it's sweet. Yeah. And it's got a softness. It's feminine. Oh, this, yeah. It's got iris in, but it's got, it's a butteriness. I was going to say, there it's is. It's got a bit of black pepper in there as well, which gives it only in the top. But once it, it dries down, it's this beautiful, powdery, slightly mm. leathery, slightly sweet. This smells um, so good. I like that one. I wore this to a job interview. Really? Yeah. You got and the job. Yeah, I got the job. Of course, I'm going to get the job. Well, yeah. You know, but <laughs> so my last job I went for, um, I wore this and I got so many compliments yeah. from it. They could smell me down the corridor this in the beautiful. therapist's room. This yeah. is beautiful because it's not overly floral because no. you, you can smell the floral in it, but it's very subtle to me. Yes. I'm getting yes. more of like a sweet powderiness. Yeah. It's got it's mm. got what I call that vintage. It's, it's a throwback to vintage, but it's it's got a bit of is it is modernity is that the word right it's modern it's slightly yes. modern it's a classy perfume yeah, yeah, i think yeah i could see mm. somebody wearing this that has basically got their crap together yeah you know definitely. they they're they're quite they're quite they've got a strong personality um like us yeah exactly i think men would like to smell this on their woman as yes well. oh yes i think it's that oh yes of, mm. Oh, yes. Yeah, and this does last. It lasts, oh, I mean, you only, a Francesca Bianchi perfumes, you only need about two sprays. For us over for, sprayers? Uh, yeah, I know, really, wow. for us over sprayers. Yeah, exactly. It's so, they're all so strong, mm. all of them so strong. And this is probably, it's going to sound a bit mm, like a contradiction, but it's the softest, but it's still of the whole collection, oh, wow. I think. But it's strong yeah that is strong like yes. i could smell it before i even put yeah the exactly so that is a winner winner what chicken dinner yes <laughs> yes <laughs> a roast chicken dinner with all the trimmings yeah. yeah oh yeah with all the so from 
an inches scale. <laughs> okay, we're now talking a bit more into my more than territory. More than five. Yeah. I'm, do you know what? I like wow. this so much. I'm giving this a nine. A nine. Yeah. Oh, my God. This is when you expect a six and you get a nine. <laughs> Don't we just love that? Yeah, exactly. So that's a <laughs> so nine. this next one is a papillon fragrance. It's not Salome. Um, it is Spell 125. Ooh. I'll be surprised if you like this. Really? I'm being completely honest. Okay. Um, it's, yeah, I'm going to let you smell it. I'm intrigued. It's medicinal, isn't it? Yes. <laughs> No. No? No. That's fine. That's okay. Mm. No, that's not a bit of me. It's got it's frankincense. Right. It's, it's got It's got but... a lot of frankincense in. I pick up a lot of frankincense. Mm. But it's got this kind of silvery feel. This kind of... Do you know it smells oily to me? I don't know why that is, but I, it, mm. it's got an oiliness about it. It's it is a very different fragrance. Papillon, mm. it's I think I'm gonna have to I see I have to smell the bottle. Mm. Yeah. I can edit it is any of this out. I it can is edit, edit in any of this out. as well. Yeah. Do yeah. whatever you want. But yeah, I it is incensey. But it's a little bit masculine. Yes, yes, it is it's very well when I look at the juice here, if you look at the juice that it just it's cloudy, looks cloudy, isn't it? Yes, it's cloudy. Yes, I don't know how many naturals are in here. This was because you've already smelt Hera, haven't you? Yes, and you didn't really like Hera. I thought it was okay, but I didn't love it. And you smelt Angelique, and you didn't really like that one because no, that's got a lot of mimosa in. I preferred Hera to Angelique. Oh, did you? Yeah, I yes, that was the one. Yeah, that because one that's your like... name, isn't it? Angelique, in, yeah. Angela in French. Angela yes, in French, yes, is. exactly. So, yeah, this is more, I I think it has more of a, it has a lightness, but it has a darkness. You know me, I go on vibes, is, I don't really go dark, on notes. Yeah. It is I dark. Think, it's gothic-y to yes. me. On, you can be honest on a scale no, of I would, one to I would ten. only ever be honest with yes, you. Yes, yeah. You know that. Three? Three out of ten. There we go. Is that one of your, <laughs> is, is you. one of your faves? It is, a, it is a big fave. It is a big favourite for me. Actually, Richard wears this a lot, if I'm it's being more, honest. I, I can see it. I'd probably like it on a man yes, more yes. than I would on yeah. I wear it on Richard. It smells beautiful as well. Yeah. It, it, and I've always had other people say to me, oh, that this smells expensive, mm. whatever expensive smells like. Yeah, I get, I get where they're it, coming it, from. It, it, it is a very much, there's not another... If you smell it, you wouldn't have smelt something like it before. Mm. Yeah, so, it's quite unique yeah. smelling. I'll give it that. So Papillon Spell 125, unfortunately, hasn't cast a spell over Ange, but it's cast a spell over me. <laughs> That's all that matters, Gail. Yeah. It's your part getting down to the wire, Gabs. It's been so much fun I know, so I know, I know. When you said the wire, I'm like, what wire? <laughs> <laughs> so the next one is a Serge Lutens. Lovely. And it's Fleur d'Oranger. It's, well, I've only ha I've had this less than a year. You talk about this one a lot, so I'm a really lot, excited. A lot, a lot. This is not your typical orange blossom. Right. Although it's got orange blossom in. And I'm about to lose my Serge Lutens. Luton's virginity because I've never smelt a Serge Luton's ever. There we go. She's, ever. She's been deplucked. She's been dethroned. Deflowered. <laughs> Deflowered. <of> <laughs> yes, all of the above. <laughs> yeah, damaged goods. Well, well, no, I'm damaged no, goods. No, when you get to a certain age, you can't <laughs> avoid it, can you? <laughs> so let's. Mm, now that, yes. That's lovely. I do like that. I mm. like orange blossom anyway. Yes. I kind of knew I would it like this one. But it also has, and you're not a fan of it, it has some citrus in there as well. I was well. going to say there's a freshness about yes, it. Yes, because I know you don't like your freshness. No, I'm not overly into yes. freshness, but you can smell a bit of freshness. It's quite clean smelling. Okay. I find. Okay. 
but I really like it. As it dries down, mm. the cumin does come through a little bit. Right. But... Yeah, citrusy. I like yeah, it. It's got a little bit of rose in there, a bit of hibiscus. It's got orange it blossom. It smells a little bit green as well. To yeah, me, it's got jasmine in there as well. But I like it. You do. So do. how would you rate that? Would you say... You, where would you wear it? I would probably wear this during the day. I think okay. like at work or something yeah. like that. I've worn it to work. Yeah, I think it's a crowd-pleasing perfume. Yeah. It's not going to offend anyone. Yeah. And it's not too heavy. I don't know what it's like when you wear it on the skin, but to me it doesn't smell yeah. like it's it, too, it too... It does have a good projection. Right. Um, Longevity is probably about six hours on my skin. Mm -hmm. I do overspray. Well, we both well, overspray. Yeah. So people, they say, oh, I spray, and they just spray two sprays. Mm. They're... That's not spraying. That's not spraying. People, that is not spraying. Exactly. <laughs> you need to add another figure to that. Yeah, double, double digits. Yeah, double then, digits. Then you're in exactly. When we get into double digits, it's an oh my god moment. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Yeah, we love that, don't we? Exactly. Oh well. <laughs> yes, exactly. You know, but there does come a certain point when enough is enough. <laughs> Speak for yourself, girl. Wow. Anyway. Yeah. <laughs> What would I rate this? Are we so on? what would you rate this? Okay. So I really like this. So I'm going to say... I'm going to say seven and a half stroke eight. Seven and a half stroke eight. Right. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, let's... Because I still like Angel's Dust more. Right. Oh, on the last one. Already? Yes, wow. we are on the last one. Time so the fifth flies. and final one. Now, this is a discontinued gem. Right. This is... If you like Angel's Dust, you may well like this as well. It's a similar vibe. Right. It does have iris in, but it has violet in as well. Mm -hmm. But it's more about the violet leaf. Right. As opposed to the violet itself. And this is Tom Ford Violet Blonde. Wow. In my opinion, it's the only Tom Ford I own. Um, although... I never used to like Black Orchid, but for some reason my nose has changed like and I, I quite like Black Orchid. Mm, I love it. Um, but I think Black Orchid is one that I would only wear if I really wanted to piss people off. <laughs> I don't know why, because I think it's that kind of perfume that it's so at the front and centre. Yeah. Whereas this one so much isn't. It's still there. Now this, um, let me just spray it. Let me just spray it. Love the colour of the juice. Oh, yeah. Mmm, that's nice. Mm. I like that. Yeah, that is nice. Not what I was expecting, though. What were you I expecting? don't know. I, I kind of was expecting something a bit more on the black orchidy side, like oh, right. as in a bit more in your face. This yes. is nice. I think it has some soft sensuality yes, about it. Yes, it is a softer yeah. fragrance and not. Like, you wouldn't know necessarily that that was a Tom Ford. It doesn't right. have that Tom yes. Ford feel, if, you, if that Is there like a, a Tom Ford DNA, then? Um, to the darker fragrances, right. the ones that I like, yes, I think so. Then that's kind of what I was expecting. But this is a pleasant surprise. I like it. I think you mm. could wear it to a formal event. I do. Yeah, it's got that kind of slightly... I feel like Rita Hayworth when I wear this. Oh. I don't know why. I feel like I want to put... A vintage scarf on and just feel and smoking, you know, like Bet Lynch used to oh, on yes. those the cigarette holders. Fur coat and no knickers. Well, exactly. As you you say. know, exactly. <laughs> you know, getting into that Rolls Royce and <laughs> indeed <laughs> unbuttoning my. Oh, I've just wow. got a frigging camisole with no bra on and I don't care. Who cares? <laughs> Once you get to a certain age. Well, you feel the heat, don't you? Yeah, exactly. And it is quite warm, to be fair. It's huge. Yeah, for it's September, yeah. it's so friggin' warm. It it's is. just... So, back to the yes, perfume. Yes, I do really like this. I can't... I don't know what's in it, though. I can't detect... Is it so well blended? Nothing yeah, is sticking out yeah, to it's, me. Yeah, it has iris in. Mm. But iris can come across sometimes as quite pungent. Mm. Whereas in here, I think it's just blended so beautifully. Mm. It's very smooth. This is a sophisticated yes, smell. Yes, yes. 
I like it. You do? I do. You like it. She likes it, everybody. Yes. So how would you rate this one? Do I like that more than the Serge Luton's? Hmm. I'm going to give that a seven because I a think seven. I like the Serge Luton's just, just a, a fraction more. better. Yeah. I would say maybe this isn't really. Would you say it's daytime appropriate? I would say Serge Luton's is daytime appropriate. Yeah, whereas... that one's a bit more dressed up. Yeah, perhaps. Yeah, yeah. going to an opera mm. or going to a show. Yeah, posh restaurant. Um, yeah, like exactly, that. Mm. exactly posh. Well, I don't Very do posh. posh but... I don't do posh. We, we can pretend to be posh, can't yeah, we? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> exactly. So Tom Ford, Violet Blonde, a solid seven. Yes. Good. So you thought it was over. Oh, no, it's not over until they say the fat lady sings. Mm. Well, I feel fat at the moment. But anyway. So nothing of you. Well, oh, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> they say you can never be too rich or too thin. Ooh, That's what they say, don't they? I, I think the rich is right, but thin, <laughs> thin. I think you can be too thin. Yeah, maybe you can, yeah. yeah. Okay, all right. I know, see, see my therapist here is speaking to me. <laughs> so the last one we have, we're going to do a wild card, another Francesca Bianchi, because Ange loved Angel's Dust so much. This is Lost in Heaven. I recently just did a video on this. Do you think I'm going to like it? What do you think? It gets mixed reactions. Okay. Interesting. They all, they all. I like it. Do you? Yeah. Oh, I like it. <laughs> that's Ooh, a plus. Is, that's a I good. I like it. Matron, I like oh, it. Matron. <laughs> oh, Matron. Oh, so. Mm, there's a sweetness in it. Yes. It has a little bit of fruitiness to begin with, yes, but I like it. it has this. Mm. I said it's a bit like my Wizard of Oz fragrance. Mm. So it's kind of like where it's so blended. It's you can't pick out really any one note mm. in it. It's quite narcotic. It's lovely. It's, I really, and it's unusual. Yes. It smells unusual because I don't think I've smelt anything like this. Yes, yes. I am really I shocked. To, I need to I check thought, this house you need out. To, yeah, because Francesca, I'm liking it. if you're watching, and believe me, she is watching. <laughs> I really like yes. that. Oh, it makes me want to smell more, I have to say. Well, so I, I, I've, I've got five Francesca Bianchi fragrances, mm. and I. It's it's getting richer as it dries down. Yes. This lasts again on the skin. Mm. It's quite deep. It's got spices in there, but it's got the it's got some florals in there. It's got some sweetness. Mm. It's a little bit leathery as well. Yeah. Um it's a little bit animalic, dare oh, I say, it. but what we what I what I say safe animalic. I was going to say it is it's, yes. it's, it's not anything that would scare anyone off, yes. I think. Mm, yes. I if really somebody like is, say, scared of Salome by Papillon, mm. because that's quite animalic. But I wouldn't be now because I've smelled it on you and it really, smells amazing. Really, exactly. You see, people's perceptions of fragrances can be quite... Before they've, I think before you've smelled fragrance, mm. sometimes you look at the notes and you think, oh my God, that's, that's got that in, me. that's yeah. not for me. Until you actually smell a fragrance. And I think it's to do with the perfume itself, the perfumer, how they're blending the perfumes yeah. as well. Um, and it's, yeah, I'm glad you love it. I love it. It's I've worn beautiful. this to work. Have you? Mm. Did you get compliments? Yes. I can imagine. Exactly. I can imagine. Exactly. Somebody said to me, mm. oh, you smell so sexy. And to be fair, this, was... this smells um, unisex to me. Yes. I can imagine a man wearing it and pulling it off as well. Although it leans a bit feminine, but I can see a man wear it too. But it's gorgeous. Mm. I like it. Mm. So out of 10, what would you... So for Angel's Dust, you really liked. Yeah. You gave that a, a nine. nine. I'm going to give that an eight and a half. Eight and a half. Yeah. Right. Because I still okay. prefer Angel's, Angel's Dust. Angel's Dust. But I do really like that. Yeah. Brilliant. Definitely. So Lost in Heaven is a winner winner. Chicken, chicken dinner. dinner. Roast chicken dinner with, with all, all the, the trimmings. trimmings. <laughs> That's our new catchphrase. That's our new catchphrase. <laughs> so guys, you've been watching another edition of The Fragrantition. Until next time. Remember, they say it's not always about 
the size, is it? It's, it's how you use it. Well, regarding from this video, it is how you use it. So, with that in mind, I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.